The Adventures of Sherlock Holmes, A Scandal in Bohemia, Part 1. To Sherlock Holmes, she's always the woman. I have seldom heard him mention her under any other name. In his eyes, she eclipses and predominates the whole of her sex. It was not that he felt any emotion akin to love for Irene Adler. All emotions, and that one particularly, were abhorrent to his cold, precise, but admirably balanced mind. He was, I take it, the most perfect reasoning and observing machine the world has ever seen, but as a lover he would have placed himself in a false position. He never spoke of the softer passions, save with a jibe and a sneer. There were admirable things for the observer, excellent for drawing the veil from men's motive and actions.